This video will cover beginner questions part 2 regarding the topic of recognize limit as derivative. Question 1. Use the definition of the derivative f prime of x equals limit as h approaches 0 f of x plus h minus f of x over h. Let's compare the two limits. The first one is the first one that f of x plus h equals cosine x plus h. Then second one is second f of x equals cosine of x. That means this limit represents f of prime of x where f of x equals cosine of x, then f of prime of x is minus sine of x. Question 2. f of prime of x equals limit as h approaches 0, f of x plus h minus f of x over h. By definition, first one is first one, second one is second one. That means f of x equals this one tangent 2x. That means this limit represents f of prime of x, where f of x equals tangent 2x. Then f of prime of x equals secant squared 2x times 2x prime use a chain rule secant squared 2x times 2 you can rewrite as 2 secant squared 2x then the final answer is 2 secant squared 2x Question 3. The definition of the derivative at a number a is f of prime of a equals limit as h approaches 0 f of a plus h minus f of a over h. When we compare the two limits, f of a equals sine pi f of a plus h equals sine pi plus h. Here, we know that a equals pi, so f of pi equals sine pi, f of pi plus h equals sine pi plus h. So f of x equals sine x. This limit represents f of prime of pi where f of x equals sine x. Then f of prime of x equals cosine x. Then f of prime of pi equals cosine pi which is minus 1 then final answer is minus 1 question 4 f of prime of a equals limit as delta x approaches 0 f of a plus delta x minus f of a over delta x. In here, f of a equals tangent pi over 4. Then this one, f of a plus delta x equals this one, tangent pi over 4 plus delta x. Now we know 
a is pi over 4 so f of pi over 4 equals tangent pi over 4 f of pi over 4 plus delta x equals tangent pi over 4 plus delta x so f of x equals tangent x this limit represents f prime of pi over 4 where f of x equals tangent x then f prime of x equals secant squared x then f prime of pi over 4 equals secant squared pi over 4 the ratio of the triangle with respect to angle of pi over 4 is 1 1 and square root of 2 in here cosine pi over 4 equals 1 over square root of 2 which is okatoa then secant pi over 4 equals may upside down square root of 2 then this one is square root of 2 squared which equals 2 then the final answer is 2. Question 5. We can rewrite as limit as x approaches 5 2 to the power of x minus 2 to the power of 5 over x minus 5. Another expression in the definition of derivatives is f prime of a equals limit as x approaches a f of x minus f of a over x minus a when we compare the two limits f of x equals 2 to the power of x f of a equals 2 to the power of 5 and x minus a equals x minus 5. Now we know a is 5. So this limit represents f prime of 5, where f of x equals to the power of x then f prime of x equals 2 to the power of x times ln 2 then f prime of 5 equals 2 to the power of 5 times ln 2 which is 32 ln 2 then final answer is 32 ln 2 this is the last one. Use the definition of the derivative f prime of a equals limit as x approaches a f of x minus f of a over x minus a. When we compare the two limits, x minus pi over 2 equals x minus a then a equals pi over 2 then f of x equals sine x then f of pi over 2 because a is pi over 2 equals sine pi over 2 which is 1 so we can rewrite as limit as x approaches pi over 2 sine x minus 1 which is sine pi over 2 over x minus pi over 2 so this limit represents f prime of pi over 2 
where f of x equals sine x, then f prime of x equals cosine x, then f prime of pi over 2 equals cosine pi over 2, which is 0. Then the final answer equals 0. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in a comment below. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.